everyone, my name is Lexilex, and welcome to my speed build of the Wooden Shield of Solitude from the game Skyrim. This is a really simple build. Um, I made this in three hours time, and I compressed this down just enough for you guys to see it in maybe about three minutes or so. This shield is made out of EVA foam, hot glue, and acrylic paint, and it's really simple. Um, I am really proud of the results that I got at the end, and I hope this inspires you guys to make something like this of your own, or um, try something else. Just inspire somebody, because that's the point of my videos. Um, so, first I start off with a whole sheet of EVA foam and draw a circle on it. The circle that I drew was really crappy, but it's just to show you guys how I generally did it with a compass that I made on my own. Just with a pen and a string. <laughs> and so you can get EVA foam in packs of four, generally at typical hardware stores for about $10 each. I used two sheets um, and glued them back to back so they are at the thickness that I wanted because um, I wanted it to be like a plaque on a wall but I still wanted it to look like a shield. Um, my hot glue gun kept running out of hot glue because of the amount of glue that I was using, I usually have two hot glue guns running at the same time. That way I never run out of warm glue because I was using so much at once. Uh, next I drew some straight lines down the shield to imitate the separate boards that the shield is made of. Um, then I took the hobby knife and cut at, along the lines, the edges of the lines at an angle to make grooves to make it look like separate boards that would make up the shield. Uh, make sure that your knife is always extra sharp, because uh, when cutting foam, it's it dulls your knife fairly easily. So, always have a sharpener on hand, or extra blades, and um, just make sure that your blade is sharp so your cuts don't get lumpy. Um, also, be careful with the sharp knives. Just like hot glue is hot, sharp knives are sharp, and you can cut yourself and burn yourself. I have too many scars on my hands to count. Um, I cannot stress that safety factor enough. Once I had the shield all put together, I chose this. I. Blah, 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 blah. I decided that I was going to paint the shield right away. Usually for uh, armor builds and that kind of thing, I use a sealer, kind of uh, latex paint or some sort like that. But for this build, it was I was using acrylic paint, which has which is basically liquid plastic anyway. So I decided just painting the acrylic straight onto the foam would be fine. Uh, foam soaked in a little bit of it, but not enough to cause a negative effect on the foam. Usually when doing builds, you do the sealer coat and then you do spray paint and that kind of thing on top of that because foam will soak up the spray paint fairly well and you'll have to do multiple, multiple, multiple... I said that really fast. Multiple, multiple, multiple... and then my voice got weird. Coats in order for it to uh, show up very well. So, for the Sigil of Solitude, I just looked up the symbol on my phone uh, and just painted it on by eye. Some people uh, will make templates and print it onto paper and then transpose that onto their projects. For me, I just did it by eye. I liked the kind of going off of a whim kind of thing and making it look more handcrafted than it was manufactured because all shields in the game look the same but that's because they all have the same texture skin and that sort of thing so I was like hey I'm just going to paint it on and see what happens and it looks pretty good in the end so I'm not complaining about it <laughs> um, I like the sigil of solitude I also like the one from uh, the storm cloaks I would have done the storm cloaks that they were that sigil was my first choice but I didn't have any blue paint at the time, so I was like, oh, what the heck, I'll just go with the Sigil of Solitude. Um, it also kind of looks like Sarge, because Sarge is a German Shepherd, and he's got the pointy ears and can be really intimidating, even if he's just a big old baby, 75-pound baby. But anyways, uh, this is my Solitude Shield build. 
thank you guys so much for watching and I hope this has inspired you guys to try out projects like this on your own. Um, building stuff like this is a lot of fun. Uh, this is something that I do just as a hobby and I've been doing it since 2009 so I've been doing it for six years. Um, I can't believe that it's actually been that long and I've gotten a lot better at making costumes and props in these past six years. So um, I like to give as much advice as I can. A lot of it is just have fun with it and make sure to be safe. Um, so if you like this video, please like and subscribe my channel and I will make more videos in the future on how to make similar things like this. I have a video coming up for my Imperial Helmet from the Elder Scrolls Online. Um, I also plan on doing other props and builds in the future of other stuff I don't really know. Uh, may I have this plan that I will be making videos of costumes and props based off of the video games that I play. So I'll be playing games like Amnesia, uh, Surgeon Simulator, I Am Bread. I will probably make a prop or a costume that will correlate with those video games somehow. And then maybe make skits with them and sketches and that kind of stuff. Which is going to be a lot of fun. I have a lot of ideas going on through my head right now. It's just a matter of time that I actually put them, flesh them out, and make it so you guys can enjoy them. Um, what else? I'm thinking here. I got my recording set up mostly done. There's just a few things here and there that I can fix um, and improve, but it's a start and I hope in the future I can start making more videos constantly for you guys to enjoy. So like I said before, please like and subscribe. I really hope you guys enjoyed this and I will put more links to videos that I've made on this channel so far. I don't have very many. Um, I keep dragging on with this outro. I am really bad at these outros. I'll get better, I promise. I'm brand new to this. So thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye!